going on probably the craziest adventure we've gone on thus far. It's gonna be a bumpy ride because the roads here are not the best. one other guest here but we have a room to ourselves let's go take a tour a okay, huge kitchen it's one of the nicer kitchens i've seen in a hostel so i'm in this one Haley's in this one we have a nice like outdoor patio but it's way too hot to sit out here credit cards do not work here so you have to have cash we think we brought enough but we need to go exchange our moldovan lay into the Transnistrian ruble. The money in Transnistria is gonna be interesting since our channel is kind of about budget travel. So they use the Transnistrian ruble and it's pretty interesting. They have plastic coins. These plastic ones are going out of circulation and the bank just sells them in this nice souvenir booklet. Why does this kid look like he's already a taxi driver? Here inside Transnistria, they don't call it Transnistria. It's uh, Pridisnov. How do you say it? Pridisnovia. Pridisnovi. Okay, so Tiraspol is Moldova's second largest city. There's a whole separate government here, separate currency, separate everything. I mean, it's technically part of Moldova. It's better than Chisinau, but it's like super, super, super light. Tears full of Bud Light. They gave us gloves to eat our burger because they knew it was going to get messy. I got a cherry burger. Oh, <laughs> wow. It's really weird. That's why I ordered it. The sweetness of the cherry jam, it's not like overly sweet. It's not like overly cherry flavor. I don't think I'd order it again. A six out of 10. Whichever is most super. I have no idea what I'm getting. Ah. It's like a fermented drink. All right, six lei. I'm sorry, six ruble. Wow. Ooh, that one's way better than the one you got the other day at the store. Yeah? I feel like that one, the flavors mesh better together. It's not overly sweet. It's not super carbonated. It's nice and refreshing. It's almost like a dark rye bread drink. <laughs> it's really good. Sharif is like a big megacorp that basically kind of runs Transnistria. Like the football team here is FC Sharif. And yeah, their name's all over, it's on everything. I think it's run by a Russian oligarch. Look at all these different types of chips. We haven't seen this brand yet. They have crab. You watch our Moldovan snack video, we eat the crab chips. Wasabi flavor. This looks like mustard. Kishinau. Dobrovar. Nasha. Baba Rosko. This is like a grandma's dream. She comes here to fill her purse with all these goodies. So much candy. We got two liters worth of local beer and two 1.5 liters of water bottles for 57 something rubles. That was the weirdest I felt in a grocery store. I think ever. The amount of employees there were for not much needing to be done. There was a babushka just constantly wiping the already really clean floor. So I don't know, it was just kind of eerie. What do you mean? Yo, what's up with these signs? All right though, I, I mean, I'll do it. Hope you guys enjoyed kind of a weird day entering a strange, strange land. I can't say it's a country, but I want to say it's a country. It is to some people.